Vaspool LP show stores what? Printing, job. Printing jobs. Right? For spool what? LP. 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 It's one what? Spool LP? For spool LP. For spool LP shows what? Stores printing job. And also, how, how, how do I know my complete printer setup? What is the command I use to see my complete printer setup? LP? LP stat, stat minus T. LP stat minus T will give the total printer setup. setup. LP stat minus T? T. 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 So Can I use SMC to create printer? Yes. No, I can't use no, no. SMC to create a printer. What is the graphical environment there for printing? What is the graphical utility available for to set up printers? Print MGR. If I use print MGR, but you need graphics, right? So we go into the print manager. Print manager, then I can create a graphic in graphical environment. I can print, right? In the early versions of Solaris, like Solaris 7, what was the utility used for graphical purposes? Admin suite. Admin suite. Okay, don't worry. It's okay. I mentioned, yeah. What is it? Print Manager does what? Create so, this, uh, graphical mode yeah. as a user, so it's going to go into the user into the user directory or folder for like to create a to add a printer or to. No, you are saying a print manager. Mm -hmm. If I say I want to create a local printer, mm -hmm. then it will ask it will automatically take your computer as the print server and it will create a printer and it will ask for. The LP1, LP2, yeah. whatever. Or if you don't want to use this, we can use a command no. called LP admin. LP admin will do what? LP admin will create printer, delete printer yeah. okay. with LP admin. Yeah, we can do right? Yeah. You can do. Yeah. Check whether P or D, right? That's it. I, I always confuse because they use in different ways. LP admin, what is that? No, Minus? This is, uh, I just keep points. You can check. Okay. Oh, not yeah. in the chest, right? To allow okay. to print service. So, how, how will I check all the print jobs? What is the command? Stat. LP stat. LP stat minus T. LP stat minus T will show my print jobs, my print environment, everything, too many things. Mm -hmm. But if I want to see only print jobs, LP stat. Okay. okay. Then how will I see all the processes running in my system? PS. 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 Or oh, PR? PS minus uh, e. A UX. PS minus A, E, F, or E. Then oh, I can use PR stat. PR stat. PR stat. PR stat also will show, right? And if I want to see all the connections between the processors, which is the parent process, grandparent process, uncle process, yeah. auntie process, SVC, all those things. SVC, SVC, no, 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 no. Process. P3. So with P3, I can see all the connections between who started which process, who is the parent process. So before I kill a process, I have to check using P3 whether this process will destroy a lo lot of other processes. So I that, whether it will have a major effect, right? Like one depending on the other, right? Oh, we can also get it from SPC. That is, SPC is for services. This is for processes. Okay. Service processes. and processes are not not same. What's the difference yeah. between the? No, same. not same. Yeah. But if service is running, then this process mm -hmm. is What's the difference between the process and the service? <laughs> what? Okay. okay, you went to a restaurant. You said I want to order a coffee. So. That ordering a coffee, nice. they are going to give you a service. What is their service? Giving you a coffee. Oh. So what are the processes starting? Process. Get the they had to beat the egg. Sorry, egg. Coffee. Maybe milk coffee. Yeah. So service will have a process, right? Oh, all those things egg they have to start. So the demons are there coffee. in the back end. Oh, These will yeah. start the demons and cook oh, will do. Cook yeah. will make that and you carry and give. So a lot of people are involved. Yeah. Okay. So how can I see all the services controlled by uh, SMF in the system? SVCS minus? Minus A. 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 SMF. Uh, SVCS minus A will show all the services, services. controlled by SMF. SMF. How do I know whether a service is enabled or disabled? 
Minus, uh, minus A will minus show whether in the first column it will show with A. When I check Solaris, say some of the some of the processors will say services will say LRC at the at the beginning. What are these? LRC means LRC legacy run control. That means uh, the old type, old type of booting. LRC means it uses init. It is init dot D or it is a RC dot D files. That is run control, old run, legacy run control, right? But if, if it is uh, SMF control, it will start with SV. SV. So this is called what? This line, this is called F FMRI. FMRI means what? Port management indicator, resource indicator. Resource identifier. Identifier, yes. Say that again, F? Ford management resource identifier. Ford management resource identifier. Okay. So, what is the advantage of SMF compared to your legacy method of starting? Here I can find dependency. Can I can find what are the services which didn't start at all by typing SVCS minus X. Okay. And then uh, lib SVC bin. Uh, the best is been uh, restore repository restore command and restore, restore the repository. So a lot of things are easy. Then I know my dependency. How will I know what 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 minus things no, are depending on D. me? Minus, minus D. 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 D or capital D. 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 Minus D. No, minus D. Minus uh, small capital means whatever is dependent on me. Whatever is dependent on me, capital D. And small D, anything which my service is dependent on. <laughs> I think all of you are ready to come and teach it. I think I should retire. She's ready to Maybe you can teach the next batch. I hate this. You can teach the next batch, I think. Right? I can retire then. No, sir, you know. Faculty. Junior faculty. Junior They have a small meeting here. Okay. <laughs> they very carried away with the SMF, right? How do I know all the services controlled by INET? INET Adam. INET Adam, right? I'm not D Adam, INET Adam. I accidentally always say D Adam. Right? Yeah. If I want to get the long listing of a one service controlled by INET Adam? INET Adam minus, minus L and the service, Red Net. And uh, how do I disable a service controlled by INET Adam? SVSC dot something. Yeah. No, no, yeah, the FMR. Yeah, FMR. Okay, how do I uh, disable? So minus D. How do I enable? Minus C. How do I enable uh, SMF service? Uh, by enable and disable. No, no, what is the command? SVC Adam. SVC Adam, SVC Adam, Adam, Adam. enable and Adam. the service. Uh, uh, can I refresh a service? Yeah, you can restart. Yes. Yes. Refresh yes. also? Yes. If I say SVC Adam refresh a service, what will happen? Not just refresh the service. Yeah, refresh the service yes. will make the service read the configuration file. For that particular service. Can you repeat again, please? Okay, every service is controlled by configuration files. The daemons are controlled by configuration files. So if I say SVC Adam refresh a particular fMRI, then the configuration files will be read once again. Yeah. SVC Adam what? SVC Adam Adam. So this will read the conf file. Reads default conf file. Re-reads. Okay. If suppose uh, you are you are repository got corrupted. Now this corruption is there everywhere, right? So your repository got corrupted. Okay. So how will you restore the repository? Oh, there's a file. We have to do user library, then we have all the stuff. No, no, there's a file. Restore repository. Restore repository, okay. yeah. Okay, that's there. Okay. So if I, if I, see, a, if I see something like this, SVC, and if it says uh, network, and if it says physical, and if it says default, then network is what? It's a service category, and this is? Uh, service, service, and that's the service and instance. That's the instance of the service. Yeah. And how do you see all the instances in a computer? Hardware instances. Hardware I'm talking about hardware, not to this instance. Suddenly jump in, right? LS hardware LS instance. How will I see all the hardware, the physical names and the hardware names? Yeah, instance LS minus names. Uh, LS, LS, LS no. minus H and slides. 
H no, 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 no. Let me forget that. All, are, all the all the instance names and the physical names are in a file. What is the name of the file? Oh, yeah, yeah. More etc path uh, underscore ah, inst. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's the important part. No? Hugo. <laughs> 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 yeah. It is path to inst. So path to inst will have what? All the instances. All the instances and their? Instance number. Instance yeah, number. Instance How many times they are occurring? Instance and name and, and physical number. Yeah. I want to create a zone. Sometimes we have to create zones because I have so many computers. Computers are keeping on increasing and increasing. So I can't just buy physical computers and uh, occupy the office. I want to buy big one computer and put many computers running in that, right? So that I can run multiple applications. So what do I use? Zones. Zones. So zones are using same kernel or different kernel? Same kernel. Same same kernel. But what is the difference between kernel? Uh, what, is the, what, are the, what is the difference between a zone and the, the real global zone, the real computer. Because the uh, inheriting anything from the global zone? The yes. By default, what are, how many directories they are inheriting? Uh, like, what are the four directories? Lib, uh, then USR, US then platform, then Lib, SDIN, platform. Has been. Has been. Has been. User. That's yeah. it. That's it. Okay. All these things. All these are by default inherited from the Current. global zone. Non -global. global zone to the. To the non-global. Which non-global? Global. Oh, non-global has three sparse, types. Sparse, 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 sparse branded, global. Yeah. Branded zone. Sparse, 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 sparse global, zone. right? And what so about the uh, branded? Branded only <coughs> uh, don't get these files. Yeah. Branded doesn't get right. Only sparse. And full root also don't get. Yeah. If I want, if I have another directory called data in the global zone, can I? Yes. Uh, inherit that also? Yeah. Okay. yeah. I can inherit. How do I, how do I make a non, uh, I mean, full root zone? Comp what do you call it? Sparse, sparse root zone and the full root zone or what? Full root zone. How will I make that one? I will remove all the inheritance. Um, if I remove all the inheritance, yeah. then it yeah. depends, right? If a zone crashes, will it affect another zone? No. no. It yes. doesn't affect. It depends. If, uh, if it is a kernel panic. If there is kernel panic, then it will affect everybody. But if it is just crashing, yeah. can you log into a zone and shut down the zone, halt the zone? Yes. Can you log into the zone and halt the zone? Yes. Yeah, I can halt the zone. Can I reboot the zone? Yes. Yes. Can I install the zone while I am in the zone? No. No. No, because you are. Yeah, I can't. Right? So there are certain things you can do within a zone, certain things you have to do from the global zone. Can I install a zone? While I log in into a zone? No. No, I have to install from the global zone, yeah, right? Yeah. So, uh, can I configure a zone while I'm inside the zone? No. no I have to no. be the global zone. No. That's it. Like that. Certain things, global zone. Who is managing the global zone? Come global zone and administrator. Right? Global zone and administrator only manages the global zone. Then, uh, then we talked about uh, name service, jumpstart. Then what else we talked about? RBAC. Then we talked about uh, printing. We talked about processors. We talked about zones. Zones. We talked about setupers. What is the advantage of setupers? Uh, all these days, we don't have to. Yeah. It's the best. Yeah. Yeah. All these days, we were depending on Solaris was depending on third party. For example, uh, Solstice, Disk Suite, later. SMC they developed, but it was not that popular, the, the meta devices which can be created through that, right? Uh, then it was always depending on Veritas, right? So after ZFS came, Solaris has built-in built in volume management capable file system. Can we create two terabytes files in Zetabyte or Zeta file system? Yeah. No, we can create Zeta. Oh, it's a um, billion, yeah. billion, billion, billions and billions of talking about. What do you mean by is that Zeta? That means no end. Last word in English language. Oh, Zeta. Words. So Z. how? 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 How means? <laughs> Where the information goes? Is the... No, that is uh, really. But you, you you don't have any information now. But I'm predicting in uh, in another three thousand years oh. that that will also become small. Three hundred thousand years. Yeah, three thousand three thousand years later. Three hundred thousand. Three thousand, not three hundred thousand. Three thousand years. Do that. The world. Another three thousand. In another 3,000 years, you 3, have Zeta years byte will be, you will have Zeta byte hard drives in your pocket. Right? Oh, yeah. our body will be. Because every time the big data, big data is increasing, right? Our body will be faster. Yeah, because you are sending emails, you are sending, uh, watching DVD uh, in your iPad, sending so many information, right? So because of that big data, 
managing big data, okay. you need big space, you big processing power, you have in-memory databases, all those you Oh, you were talking about.